marketing push for No Man's Sky is finally upon us. We got the first trailer released this past Thursday, which appeared to be the first in a set of four videos that focus on the pillars that the game was based upon, which happened to be Explore, Fighting, Trading, and Surviving. This first video focused on the exploration aspect. And man, oh man, did this trailer look fan Fantastic. Uh, first of all, this was the, I think, the most well edited trailer so far we've had for the game. In addition to that, we got to see some really strange stuff. I mean, this stuff was out there in this trailer, especially when you freeze the, the frames in between because a lot of them went by really fast just so it could sync with the music. And in those short clips, there was some really strange stuff in this trailer and it really just speaks to the variety that will be in this game when they say that there's just there's an an unrivaled amount of variety in this game when you compare it to anything we've had in the past then you know this trailer it shows it the planets the the atmospheres the literal atmospheres the uh the creatures the ships it looks so fantastic like there were so many moments in this game that were screensaver worthy. You could just take a picture and it just looked really cool. In addition to a lot of the variety that they demonstrated and the new exploration aspects of the game, we also got a glimpse into what the game really it looks like now compared to what it did in the past. When you compare this current trailer, trailer to the past trailers, you can see that this build of the game which i assume will be is the same build that will be at launch and it'll probably be a day one update as i mentioned in the previous video they're already working on the first update for the game there's probably a lot of work that went into the visuals if they had not taken this time to further flesh out the game and work on those key moments as they spoke about before when they were giving reasons as to why they delayed the game so that it, it, it looks really exciting. It looks a lot better graphically. The ships, it was an instance where we got a glimpse at a flying saucer type ship and it looked very large. We also got a glimpse at a massive space station and a huge, absolutely massive capital ship out in the distance as he like warped in into an orb the orbit of a planet there was this massive capital ship it looked so cool i wonder if you can go inside that ship and and it just it looks really cool i'm really excited about this i think we can expect to see the next trailer next week probably around the same time and the next trailer you can expect to be focusing on the fight aspect of the game as highlighted by the trailer it's probably going to release the trailers in sequence and i'm guessing there will be a final launch trailer after all of these videos have been released focusing on the pillars of the game there'll be a final big launch trailer and then the game's release some more news concerning sci-fi games if you didn't know star wars celebration is happening right now in the UK, London to be specific, and during the EA panel, they announced new DLC for Star Wars Battlefront. Now, I know Star Wars Battlefront was disappointing to a lot, a lot of gamers, a lot of Star Wars fans because of different reasons, one of them being the lack of space battles. Well, I'm here to tell you that this DLC will include space battles and it will be focused on the Death Star as highlighted by the teaser trailer released today.
This trailer, as always, looks great. The video department at DICE does a great job really highlighting the presentation, the visuals, and what it's going to be like to participate in gameplay in these trailers, and it just looks really, really good. There was a gl even a glimpse of trench warfare, of them flying through the trenches of the Death Star to, hit, to uh, launch the proton torpedo and take out the Death Star. I wonder how it's going to play out if uh, what it, the maps are going to look like because of course there's going to be ground maps as well in, inside of the Death Star. I'm guessing there won't be, you won't be able to play typical modes such as Walker Assault because I don't know if there's any areas big enough. Perhaps they did design maps uh, large enough inside the Death Star to accommodate that game mode but I, I don't think so. There'll probably be some new type of game modes that will happen but this looks really exciting and also to add on to this, they announced that the final DLC coming out, I think next year will be, will, or at the end of this year, will contain Rogue One content. So that's something to look forward to. Rogue One looks great. I'm excited for that. As I'm always excited for Star Wars stuff, and this movie looks like it's going to be no exception. Well, that's it for today. Uh, if you liked the video, please hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. What do you think about this No Man's Sky trailer, and are you excited for the next one and which video are you excited about the most is it ex exploration the survive one the the fight trailer which will probably be, be probably be the next one or are you most excited about the trading aspect let me know in the comment section down below don't forget to subscribe for more content follow the channel on twitter so you can be notified when the latest uploads happen as always stay super and i'll see you in the next video